when he gets up far enough where he can see the other cruiser, he just hits the engine and it goes at him and runs right into him. East Liverpool police are now working with fewer cruisers on the streets. Two East Liverpool cruisers were badly banged up Thursday in a chase. It started with a domestic call disturbance. Two officers needed checkups from it, and the police chief thankful the ending wasn't worse. First News reporter Jacob Thompson has the story. On Thursday around 7.30 p.m., an East Liverpool officer went to Reynolds Street for a domestic call. Police reports show it started out as an argument between 32-year-old Shane McCutcheon and the victim. She told police she asked McCutcheon to leave a number of times before he threatened to shoot her and take their children. Officer gets there and he immediately takes off. He hits the car before he leaves and then they turns into pursuit. He's trying to stop him. The officer sees him leave and tries to stop him. McCutcheon was driving an F-250. The officer tried to pull him over before heading down Valley Avenue, which is a dead-end street. They were thinking he was going to bail there at the end. He'd go to the end and jump out and run, which he didn't. He just spun around on him, and he backed into him again. That's where he flattened his tire. At that time, another officer is turning onto Valley Avenue, and McCutcheon went right after that officer. He just, just sits and waits, thinks, I got, we'll see what he does. As soon as he's seen the officer, he just, he just gunned the engine and took off and rent right into him, hit him head on. After they crashed, Chief Lane says McCutcheon kept pushing that officer with his truck. He tried to back up before hitting the first officer. Afterwards, both officers were able to pin him in. In this photo, you can see where the officers tased him. Both officers did end up going to the hospital just in case. At first, neither one of them wanted to go to the hospital. And I said, no, you got, what if you wake up the next day and you can't get out of bed? You know, we have to have that stuff in, order, in line to protect them. Now McCutcheon is facing multiple charges, including felonious assault on a police officer and resisting arrest. But Chief Lane says this could have ended up much worse. You have a big heavy truck like that, it, it could have really been bad. I mean, it, thank God the way it turned out, no one's serious injured, you know, even him. Bond has been set at $100,000. In East Liverpool, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.